<laughs> Haven't <laughs> heard that. <laughs> dun, 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 that is, that's my childhood. Like any any Intel computer that was advertised on telly had that sound. That was my childhood right there. <laughs> oh, that's good. I I must not have watched past the Lenovo side because I didn't even know that was gold was in there. But here we go. What? Oh, that, Steve, mate, that's... that looks beautiful. Absolutely that beautiful. is. Is that like a leather finish on the top? It's a proper leather finish that they've um it, like sourced from ecological places and is handmade. Um, it doesn't you you've got the option to get that leather or just to get a metal finish, but damn yeah. that leather finish looks it, it nice. Looks pre, it looks premium, um, right? It looks like it would just sit right <laughs> on a desk. You know those desks that have got like the big big like oak desks right and they've got the, yes. that little mat that sits one. on top and it, oh mate it looks it that, looks uh premium that i mean mate that looks that, good and that pen port oh mate oh, did you yeah. see my eyes i know we can see each other's cameras when we were playing but did you see my eyes just pop out i was like mate that I is did. good yeah that is good. You like, even had to comment. Yeah, yeah, I had to jump on as a guest and comment. I was well happy with that. <laughs> that uh, is so cool. And that is a self-charging pen port as well. So, you know, that pen that's Ooh. in there charges off it. Um, oh, my gosh. So this is obviously a uh, Windows Ink compatible device. The uh, the 7i, the, the other one, it has the optional pen support on it. Um, mm -hmm. But this one has pen support on all the devices and it's native in. out of the box with the pen yeah yeah That's so good. that is pretty awesome unless they're going to change anything from now and when it arrives in stores every device mm. should have it in the box um and imran you shouted out the soundbar on it and i think that's probably one thing that caught everyone's attention yeah so and the positioning I, of it the positioning of it wherever smart. you yeah wherever you kind of had that positioning of the screen meant that the soundbar was at its optimal angle for you for your viewing cool. for your viewing pleasure um so cool. oh man you remember good old hannah reynolds of course steve it's hard to forget such a, a beautiful she, person what she is a legend <laughs> a legend in the game <laughs> <laughs> she she actually because she worked for lenovo for a little bit and mm. uh she actually showed me a device that had a speaker like this that Lenovo had in the past. And it sounded great then. And mm. it's about a year, two years on from then. So it's going to sound even better now. And like you said, that positioning, you can set it up to face you no matter what angle you're on. So the audio is actually coming towards you, not bouncing off surfaces. It. Um, it's got, I can even tell you <laughs> just because I know how much you like your audio. Mm. um it's got like two tweeters in it as well as two subs um so yeah, <laughs> there's there's good. a few speakers in there and uh dual webcam mics as well so i, I would hesitate to say that it's going to sound better than uh omnisonic speakers <laughs> cool. i just noticed my dog's just walked in and he is soaking wet <laughs> I, I have no oh, idea where he's been. He's probably been for a swim in the uh, pool. He's just walked in and he's like, hello, dad. And he's, <laughs> he's just drenched. Where's he gone? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Um, but uh, can, can I just touch on the battery life? I mean, as well. Yes. Um, because the battery life. So I, I'm reading up on it as well as we go. Yeah. It's It uses dynamic tuning technology. And that uses machine learning to ma to predict workloads. And then maximize yeah. the battery life throughout how it's being used. And so they're predicting how you're going to be using this device. This, it, I mean, look, so cool. how is how amazing <laughs> is that? And then it will it will shift workloads to to, uh, to to and minimize different areas to be able to maximize that battery life <laughs> out of it. And I think it says it gets uh, an average life of 13 hours of use, which yeah. Again, with a device with that power, that screen, that audio, everything, 13 hours is a decent, <laughs> decent amount. And um, even with UHD, like video playback, it's still nine hours. Like, it's it's so good. Um, Dave has just asked a question, though. Um, with Windows inking on Lenovo 2 and ones I've had 
trouble with customers using the Microsoft pen. Can um, customers use the Microsoft pen or do they need to get Lenovo pens? Well, it should work fine on them, um, but obviously Lenovo has the opportunity to tune and tweak their devices to work with their mm. pens, um, probably in a, in a better way. So it, yeah. uh, it's good to know, um, get that feedback, Dave, because we can pass that on. Um, mm. So yeah, maybe in the meantime, do try pair it with a Lenovo pen um, yeah. because that will have been tested pretty heavily. I, I think I think also that the manufacturers mm. build their their products to work best with their with their products. So like Surface Pen, mm. for example, we know works best on Surface. It's it, the technology is mirrored between the Surface device and the pen to get that most out of it. I imagine that it's it's pretty similar. I know it, I know it's similar with Samsung and their pens. Um, um, so I imagine that again, Lenovo would be uh, would be very similar to maximize their usability. Yeah, absolutely. And um, so, like this, this is just a laptop that keeps on giving with great features. It has pretty much everything we've talked about um, in the the Seven I um, is available. You've got that you know, privacy, shutter, um, they've both got Alexa um, and Cortana support as well, um, depending on mm. the region you're in as well. Um, this one, though, we've we've had a question. Um, sorry, was it Stephen? Stephen said, what's Windows Hello features given? I'm a big fan. So this device with that edge-to-edge glass um, palm rest that it talked about which is just mm. means it's like a glass finish so it feels really nice to rest your palms on um <laughs> actually built underneath it as well is a fingerprint scanner is so it? you can sign in with a fingerprint scanner um through through that glass palm rest Man. so that is uh that's pretty cool and it, oh, that combined with that convertible look the sound but the design this is this is a beast. I mean, look. Oh, the garage pen. You're selling this device to me. It's got it's rapid stellar. charge, so 15 minutes will give you two hours of battery life on this this bad boy. Like and This is starting to is become great. a big thing in, in a, you know, I, I, the ability. I know that the chipsets are, are really helping out with that. And um, mm. it's, it's big with a lot of the OEMs when we talk about... Um, rapid charge quick charge fast charge however they're calling it <laughs> like we have fletch you and i we went to a a, a digital road show very recently didn't we where we yeah we actually made it our mission to to ask each oem about their rapid charge technology and and where we're going to start to see it what kind of devices we're going to start to see it in is it just going to be premium are there going to be devices that have entry level with rapid charge um Really, there's a lot of pe- there's a lot of OEMs that are sh- that are really trying to make sure that rapid charge is the well, it's becoming the industry standard now, uh, which is amazing yeah. because our phones do it, and now our computers <laughs> are going to start doing it. So I love it. I think it's good. Absolutely, and uh, we've had questions coming in, so we're, we've already we've we've got prizes to give to people. So Stephen, Dave, and uh, Imran, you've been asking questions left, right, and centre. You are all going to get a great Microsoft zipped up hoodie. So it should be different to the ones I haven't seen them. Have you seen them? Um, I've seen them once. I don't have a picture of them though, but uh, we'll see what we can we can find. Maybe we'll post one so you guys know what you're getting. Yeah, I'm excited. Um, Zip up hoodie. I might try and ask the question myself. (laughs) (laughs) So yeah, there you go. I want one too. Um, I'm wearing my old school classic Surface hoodie today. Not even the. The latest one, but uh, Imran has asked as well. Has any other manufacturer made something like the Surface Studio Two or even close? I've actually seen. I don't see. I'm bad with knowing names of all in ones. Uh, I, I, I know exactly. Say what you're that about. straight away. <laughs> yeah. But Lenovo actually do have a similar one that pushes mm. right down. I've I've even mm. seen it used as like pause and and like restaurants and stuff. Mm. So there are similar ones, not quite as premium in the look and feel. Um, yeah. And but, I think the technology to do yeah. where where the studio cut. I mean, look, I'm, I'm here. We go again. I'm going to go on my surface <laughs> rant. But where the where the studio kind of differs to all of that is the technology that's in there to be able to kind of empower yeah. like architects, designers, graphic designers, things like that. But yeah, I mean, there are devices out there from Lenovo and other people that that have a similar form factor and a similar usability there. Mm, absolutely. So. 
I know that we got to keep going because we do want to do a little quiz. We love doing quizzes with you guys um, to wrap yeah, it up. Boy. And we've got one more device to talk about. But, but before do we I... get there, Steve, I just want to share my screen um, because I have to show you my new favorite color. And it's not even on one of the specific devices we talked about today. Mm. Um, it is on another um, yoga that, that I was could say, be coming this out. Isn't even on, is it, is it just <laughs> an opportunity for you to just share your new favorite color? Oh, I just want to show my new favorite color. Look at that green. It's like an olive drab, like a military green that they're introducing to their devices. Look at I you. I love Using it. Words. Oh, my God. I uh oh I just uh, I'm sorry it's not e we're not even going to talk about it just look at that beautiful green let's see if we can get a better color look at all the colors that are coming out to be fair but oh, I just saw it I saw a better picture but I'm not going to waste your time hunting it down but that okay. green I love <laughs> that green just got to share it orange again look. I loved that burnt orange I know Steve would have too. <laughs> Yeah, orange is my favorite color, but like I'm, no. I'll, I'll be honest, like Imran is not a fan of the green, as you can see his face. Oh, <laughs> he, he is I, not a fan. Uh, look, I, to be fair, I love, <laughs> I love an I'm olive inclined drab. to agree with Imran. About? I'm inclined to agree with it's, him, mate. I mean, it's look, so you, cool. I know that you're a fashionable guy, mate, and I can see by your dress sense. <laughs> you know, uh, I've, I've met you on many occasions, but <laughs> I, uh, I'm sure you're a very fashionable guy, but green. Oh, yeah. you, <laughs> oh don't oh. worry kev i've got kids i know exactly what you're talking about i know exactly what you're talking about oh but like you can you guys can see that that red chest i've got in my background with like the u.s army symbol on it it's that u.s army green i i, I all the haters can hate the green is one of the best colors ever to come to oh well, good they'll tell one <laughs> <laughs> so oh, Fletch will be buying a new green. <laughs> I need to go check that out now. So, Dave, oh, you have, you'll sent me on a mission. Yeah. I've got I've got my classic. I can't buy a new phone. I only got one recently, so uh, but I've got my you know midnight blue or whatever Samsung calls their their blue black. <laughs> okay, okay. With my yeah, my you, green that I had to show. Your color choice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> getting ripped for it hard but that's okay i'll uh i'll bring it back i've got another banger another banger to play <laughs>